Made for entertainment purposes only. Don't take it seriously. What's the problem? What's the problem? Hey man, let's get to it. Let's get to it. Let's get to it, though. So, uh, Chris Brown and Blueface going at it, talking about you know why Chris Brown said why y'all bringing up what I did when I was seventeen, and Blueface and Sean Rock fighting each other like wild animals and shit every day and week on Zeus. Uh, how you feel about that? Uh, yeah, I don't know. Like, I don't really too much keep up with it, but. Yeah. The whole toxic situation thing, I'm I'm not a fan of. It. I mean, I I feel like it's reality. You know what I mean? Like I feel like it's a lot of people that go through it, and right now, shit, it's making them they popping. So, so I feel like I would continue doing what I'm doing. Honestly, I feel like that's their real life. So, I don't know. right? You, do you follow them on social media? Uh, I follow Christian because I watched that Baddies West show. So yeah. So you are you? A supporter of her domestic uh, violence or uh, relationship, she got this this toxic situation. Uh, I wouldn't say I'm a supporter, I say I'm a supporter of her. Shit. The whole toxic thing, like, nah, I mean, but it is what it is because I feel like that's really her reality. But supporting it, not really, but I mean, I don't judge it either. Wow, wow. a lot of women still going at Chris Brown from 17 years ago, though. They ain't getting mad at Krishan Rock for knocking and hitting him. They, she knocked Blueface outside the head with a Hennessy bottle. He had glass in his head, and she tried to use a glass to suck it out, though. This idiot. So why aren't people keeping the same energy with her? Why is that? Uh, I'm not sure. I mean, me personally, I don't fault Chris Brown. Like, oh, it is what it is, really. I mean, I feel like it's just life. I don't still fault him about it. Why, he why? just happened to be famous, and people are on his neck about it. It happened in real life every day with everybody. So, not everybody, but a lot of people. When Chris Brown did it, he had to apologize to all females, and and then he had, then he still apologized from damn near almost twenty years ago and shit. I'm like, damn, how long are he gonna be sorry? That's just because he in the light, though. You know, that's just because he's famous. This man, I'm this man, they done did songs together. They done went back to start fucking again. I'm like, why people can't just let this shit go, bro? And it's only black women doing this because white women ain't doing this. It just so happen he's just famous. Bro. You are you a Chris, are you a Chris Brown supporter still? Uh, I, mean, I like his music. That's about it. I like his music. I like his music. That's about it. I, mean, I don't really right. know. I really know him to like him. So. Right. That's another thing. What's your thoughts on people when they say I don't like that certain celebrity or famous person? Uh, when they don't even know that person, you see what I'm saying? Uh, I ain't gonna lie, I don't know. It's kind of weird, but that's just, I don't know, I think that's just like, shit. I do, I ain't gonna say I don't like people. I have my opinion about people, but just straight up not liking them, shit, I don't know. I'm yeah, saying. I'm like, how you know You ain't never met this person. Right. Even if you meet somebody one time, that don't mean you know him. You just had a briefing with him, you see what I'm saying? You ain't gonna take your time to get to know somebody to say, I don't like them. Okay. Right. Got you, got you. That shit wild on Blueface. So you watch, you don't watch that show on Zeus? What? Uh, Blueface and Christian Rock. You watch that show on Zeus? Yeah, I've seen it. Oh, wow. Is it, why do you think so many people are so entertained by they, they dysfunction? Because I believe it's, they, it's, re, it's their reality for real. Like, I feel like that stuff happened to people in real life. Like, it's just not on their platform. You get what I'm saying? Like, people just don't have a platform so they can see it. So, I don't know. Well, facts. Do you feel, you feel like a lot of women uh, care about what men think? I don't know. I don't. <laughs> I don't. I can't speak for everybody, but yeah. I don't. Yeah. Care about Your personal people. opinion, though. Uh, probably. I mean, I don't know. You, you, so you say you don't care? What other men think? Yeah, I'm saying you care how men feel. You feel like society care how men feel. Oh, you mean like 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 a man like his part like him personally like his feelings? Or yeah, something? yeah, like his feelings. Oh yeah, I care. I mean, not everybody. I don't care about everybody, but I care. I feel like it's very important, just like how women's feelings are important. I think it's very important for men's feelings. Right. Yeah. How old you? Is? I'm 23. Okay. Right. Why do you think a lot of women um leave relationships first though? 
Oh, way too late. Uh, I don't know what you do a lot of reasons. Give us a couple reasons. You ain't got to go through a whole list of, like, what's a couple reasons why you left relationship? What, what's your reason on why you left those relationship personally? So, I would, I would say I've only been in, like, two real relationships, honestly. And, like, but I was, like, I was a kid when I first got in a relationship. So, the very first time I got in a relationship, I was, like, in, like, my grade. But I feel like that stuff don't matter. But, um, a guy cheated on me. I left my life. And... My second relationship, like, and it's crazy because I recently just got out of a relationship, like, eight year on and off relationship. So I was like 15 type shit. But, um, I've left multiple times because, shit, I thought that was the best thing to do. I didn't really have no guidance in my relationship. So I thought leaving was just easier to do, you know? But, I think it's women, you said they can keep playing about the men, but I think it's y'all the ones leaving the relationships. Everything on the men? Put everything on me. I would have put everything on me. I mean, I feel like men play certain roles, just like females. But I don't know. some, I don't know. I feel like some women rather just leave. Some men rather stick it out. But I can't speak to everybody. Right now, now you talking about everybody. We just talking about your personal opinion, your humble opinion. You know, so right, right, okay, cool. So you, so. uh so let me ask you this though: Do you feel like a lot of people like, like a lot of females post thirst traps and like twerking videos and stuff, so a blue check can slide in their DMs and they can get attention? Uh, not necessarily. I feel like like if it was me, like I post thirst traps sometimes. Whatever, need to get people attention. It's just shit. I might feel confident about myself that day. I feel like why, I why, why do you post thirst traps though? What, what's the reason behind it? I'm saying, I'm saying, like, I might have felt good today. I'm not doing it for attention. I just don't happen to have a fat ass in real life and shit. It's just what it is. Like, you doing it for attention, bullshit. You can, lie to, you can lie to some people some of the time, but you can't get that bullshit past Jay Reed. You doing it because you want a certain guy to be in them DMs. That's what it is. I get that every day, though. That's nothing. See, that type of stuff don't really phase me, though, like. I don't care about all this stuff. It's not. It's not me. But, it's for attention. Like but, I said, I, flaunt, I, I believe you're flaunting for attention, uh, subconsciously, unconsciously though. Subconsciously, you're doing it for attention. So you mean to tell me if a certain blue check slide in your DMs, you're going to deny him? Uh, I mean, it all depends. But I'm not doing it to get it in my DM though. But it all depends. Like, shit, why not? Right, right. Whatever helps you sleep better at night, though. So, what? when you post these third trap videos or these videos, you try to show off your ass. Uh, do guys be sliding your DMs though? Do you are you looking out? Because I know they they hit the DMs or whatever. Like, are you responding back to everybody? Are you blocking them? Are they sending you pics? Like, whoa, what's up with that? I get all the above. I don't just block. I don't just block people right off the real. I get people in my DM just by showing my face. Like I said, my, my, my ass just so happy to be fat, you know, I mean, shit. But, I mean, I don't block people, I ain't gonna lie, like, I don't block people unless they just get to act weird, like, calling me, like, don't know me, but calling me, you know what I'm saying? All that type of weird shit. But I don't block my own face, and I don't even respond sometimes. So. Well, female you know, love attention, bro. Attention is the root of all evil now. Attention. Men do too. Men so, do too. You know, you said what? Men do too. We ain't what? talking about the men. See, females always want to do that in the argument. Like we having a discussion. What? Well, what do men do it too? You men do it too. What the hell men got to do with this? I'm saying though, like, what would be your opinion with men showing off they, they got the gray sweats on and they print showing like, what, how do you feel about the that? same reason they doing it for you. They, 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 they all attracting one another. That's what y'all doing. The, the the Instagram thoughts and the attention whores attracting the, 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 the city boys. City boys attract city girls. That's amazing to me. Y'all attract one another and then complain about one another. Why complain. is that? I don't complain. I don't know. I don't complain. So you just roll with the punches? It don't phase me. It don't bother me. Okay. Don't, that type of stuff just don't bother me. Mm, okay. Are you a city girl? Am I a singer? Are you a city girl? No, I'm not a city girl. So you're not for the streets? No, I'm not for the streets. No. Oh. So you don't feel like females who post thirst traps are for the streets? Maybe I, I can't really give you my full opinion because that's not me. I don't know. Maybe they do. Mm. Right, 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 right. Okay, okay. So, 
This right here, you want them guys to slide in right there for you. No, trying to show off her ass right there, guys. No, I just so happen to dye the back of my hair. That hairstyle's called. <laughs> Bullshit me. You you know what? This sounds like. Hold on. If you go to the other picture, you tripping. Go to the other picture because I show my face also. I show my orange hair in the back. Like, you just, I feel like, yeah, you own me. Come on now. Don't you own you. I ain't on you. No. I ain't touching you. I ain't on top of you. I ain't on you. <laughs> I'm just trying. I'm just trying to be the obvious though. So like, so like, does it boost your ego when those guys be in your DMs liking your pictures? Like I said, they still don't phase me. I get that every day in real life. Oh my God. Like, okay, no, like, we are okay. We established everything. that you get that in real life, but you're not asking the question. Does it boost your ego? No. Okay. You feel like uh okay. You feel like guys who follow you on social media, you feel like those like your fans? No. I feel like I mean, I wouldn't say fans. I would say they find me attractive. That's just like if I find a, if I find a man attractive, I'm gonna follow him. Like, so you feel like you should be in a relationship and follow the opposite sex on social media? Huh? Do you feel like if you're in a relationship you should follow the opposite sex if you're in a relationship. Uh, yeah, I mean, I love you too, Kawhi. Sorry, but um, it's good, it's cool. I feel like I think it's all about uh people insecurity. Like, I don't mind. I ain't gonna lie. They don't get me wrong. Like back in the day, not fuck back in the day. A couple of months ago, I would have felt like that me being in a relationship, but that was only because of my insecurity. If somebody ain't reassuring me, then I mean. Like, if I know me and my person are good, then it doesn't bother me. Right. Okay. Okay. So you feel like so you feel like if you in a relationship or getting to know somebody, it's okay for uh guys to slide in your DMs and comment under your pictures and stuff. Uh, I mean, I don't know. Like I can't control that. Okay. So Okay. All right. I think it's all about me if I'm entertaining it. Mm. I'm gonna then it would be a problem maybe, but I can't help if somebody find me a track on the comment under my picture. So you you follow a lot of guys on social media? Do I follow a lot of guys? Yeah. I follow both. I follow girls and guys. No match about the guys. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, sure. So you be sliding in their deal or you or they slide your I mean, it's probably a mutual thing. Not right now I don't. I mean, it's probably a mutual thing. So, no, no, don't read the comments. Don't read the comments. Focus on me. Focus on me. <laughs> so, it was, all right, right. So, but this is what I think. I'm thinking with social media, people feel like they got, they, they boost women ego, I feel like, social media. But people follow people they don't even see in real life, though, especially. They ain't gonna never see in real life and shit. I just find it strange. Don't you? Huh? Don't you do that? We ain't talking. You talking about me. See, we, we're not gonna do that right there. Okay. Ma'am. You're right. We're not gonna do that right there. My bad. <laughs> Don't you feel like that is kind of strange or it boosts women's ego when guys are following them and they don't and they're not going to see them in real life? Uh, I wouldn't necessarily say it boosts their egos. I mean, it's kind of cool to be looked at by people like, like you said, like a verified ego or something like that. Like, niggas that but that's why you do that. You're doing what you're doing so a blue check can slide in those deals. I feel like that's why a lot of women post what they post so they can get that blue check. <laughs> Well, I mean, I feel like that's your opinion. Cause me, that is my opinion. opinion. I ain't saying it was long. That's well, just my opinion. Well, no. But, yeah, I'm not like, nah, I don't do that for other people to look at me. I mean, I mean that's what social media is for, though. You post it so other people can look at you. But that's not just a... You want to be a celebrity? I'm not a celebrity. I said, do you want to be a celebrity? No, not at all. I want to be rich. I don't want the fame. Why you want to be rich, though? But who doesn't want to be rich? You know, your rich don't mean all your problems go away, though. You just more money just sometimes give you more problems. All right. But I want a lot of money. I want to be comfortable. I want to be stable. I want to, you know, that type you, of thing. Do you I want to talk to a celebrity? Do you want to have sex with a celebrity? Um, maybe once. Like, I why you? Why do you desire a celebrity? That's why women. I feel like I don't desire a celebrity. But if there was to come, then okay, cool. What, what celebrities though? Probably Kodak, Black, Kodak Black, um, Honeycomb, Brazy, those type of guys. So you like street niggas and killers? 
I wouldn't necessarily say I like their personality. They just so happy to be street a street nigga. Oh my god. They they work on other people, but they don't work on me experienced guys. <laughs> Like, so do you like do you you ever had sex with a, with a criminal before? I feel like you have sex with criminals. Um, maybe, maybe once, probably. Maybe once. But so, not, okay. not well, I don't know. Probably, I don't think so. Though. Like, why you like criminals? Why do you think a lot of women like you are attracted to criminals? Who said I was attracted to criminals? I'm, I mean, I'm just asking though. I'm just asking because those guys you just said, honeycomb braces in time doing prison, and his family and his grandma and his granddaddy are dead because of his street beef. That ain't got I don't to know. Do with me, though. I, 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 so wait, 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 wait. Slow down, slow down. I'm, I say that to say that because those guys are involved in street activities or criminal activities. That's why their loved ones have been shot at and killed. Some of these guys you just named. So that's why I say, why do women like you like criminals? Um, honestly, I just like their music. I like, like I said, I like their personality. But I mean, and honestly, it's something I can relate to. Like, I come from the projects. Like, I'm a project kid. So why do they try to always make all black people come from the hood in the projects? I am and glorified. I'm not glorifying it. It's just that's just my life. I'm not glorifying it. That's something that I can relate to. Like, that's just that. I'm not glorified. It's just so happy. It's just that. So, you like, I, I, I don't desire to be with these guys. You asked me if I wanted to have sex with them. Shit, that would be somebody but I would say it. Why do, but I answer a question, though. You kind of did really I answer it. it. Why are women like you attracted to criminals, though? What do you mean, women like me? I just told you, I'm somebody that can relate to them. So, like, so you're saying it's relatable. So, you, so you're saying because you grew up in the project with criminals. That's why you're attracted to other criminals? I'm not attracted to them, but like I said, I can relate to them. I can understand them. So you relate to criminals? What the world? What? You relate to, that's what you just basically say. You relate I'm to saying criminals. like they like they lifestyle, they background. I can relate to it. Like That's okay. So I'm just why why is it a big deal? You relate to criminals, right? I mean I guess. You get E B T cards? What? Do you get E B T? No, I don't get E B T, but if I could I would. Okay. It, you have you have a child? I do have a kid. How many? How many you got? Just have one kid. It's, it's just yeah, singular. Is your baby daddy a criminal? No. So he ain't. So he wasn't in the projects or the streets. Why does that matter? I'm just asking. I don't want to speak on him though, cause I mean I don't want to speak on. Him. That's cool. I just ask, ask the question though. You ain't gotta be offended though. I just I'm ask. Not offended. I'm not offended. I just I don't want to speak on. Him. Okay. Okay. But he's not. But he's fine. That's cool. That's fine. That's fine. We ain't got to, though. Uh, I just asked that to see, was he a criminal, too, though? Because usually a lot of women, uh, when they have baby daddies, they want different type of men. But I'd be, like, trying to tell them, me personally, my humble opinion, that you can't get hired in your baby daddy. If your baby daddy's a criminal, that means your future guy you have to be with got to be a criminal. Because how can you elevate if you if you had a baby by a criminal? You can't expect your damn baby daddy to be a nine to five. So you trying to tell me that's just like you said a man that was a criminal like what if he working nine to five what do you mean like, well what, why would any, why would a woman have a baby by a criminal because you know how two things just happen death for the grave so I don't I'm, I'm not gonna say you said why would a woman have a baby by a criminal you act like yeah no I, like, oh I want that criminal I want to have a baby by him no nah, that just so happened to be his background like that's just what it was no 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 everybody got a choice though. What if what if he wasn't a criminal at first and then he just so happened to do something down the line? Then oh he just a criminal. regardless of the fact though, everybody life is about choices though. That's what that's, I'm saying. That, though. that has nothing to do with me though. If I if I just like okay, since we talking about it, for you, okay, my, my kid's dad was an athlete. He played sports. He's not a criminal, but he has been to jail. That doesn't make him a criminal or whatever. You, you are a criminal you've been, been to jail before. You're you're an ex convict. Or whatever. I've been to jail I guess I'm a criminal too. That criminals just criminals, man. Okay. You never been to jail before? Uh, no, I haven't, and don't want to be. I mean, no, man, thank you. Nobody wants to be. It's just so. It's just happens. It, you know, well, nothing happens. Everything's by choice, though. I mean, I guess because because when you go to that white man, you can't tell him about your childhood. That white man don't care. That white judge not gonna care about how you was raised. 
All he feel like is everybody got a choice and the re responsibility in life to make the right decision. You know right from wrong, though. That's what I'm saying, though, my humble opinion. Yeah. But, but that's cool, though. That's cool, though, because uh, I just find it funny, though, that only black women I hear are attracted to these guys, though. I've never heard white women say this. Well, white women do like bad boys, too, but they don't get pregnant by these men. They just get fucked by them. They practice safe sex. But I don't hear a lot of white, mostly Asian people, Mexican, Japanese. Why is it in the black community that women are having sex with killers, robbers, pedophiles, and making babies with these men? Why do you think that is, though? I don't, I don't have I don't, I don't have sex with pedophiles. Ah, we're, talking about, we're, we're talking about your opinion on why this happens in the community, though. I don't know. You don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, you don't know. You, so why why you think so many black women are attracted to criminals, though? I can't tell you. I don't know. That's I don't know. Like I don't know. You, are you still attracted to those type of guys? The real niggas in the street. I'm attracted to. Who I'm attracted to. If he just don't happen to have a criminal background, that's just him. I'm not gonna judge him for it. I mean, it is what it is. Mm. What's a real nigga? Oh, I see a criminal. Oh, I want him to be my, like, I'm not going like that. Like, it's just but, but what is a real nigga to you, though? That's a real nigga? Yeah. Uh, somebody that's, that tell the truth and still have their way. Somebody that take care of their kids. Somebody that, you know, positive person. I don't know. Mm. Okay. So they say, because you're like in the... You say what? Excuse me, what you say? Somebody can handle their business the right way. Mm. Right. And they, are you, you like real niggas? I think I'm a real nigga. Mm. Well, I feel <laughs> like the real niggas got to go to prison, though. Because all the real niggas even in the bed are in prison, though. So that I don't want to be a real so, nigga. So, that mean you're, so you don't consider yourself a real nigga? No, I'm not a real nigga. I'm just a regular man. I'm a civilian. I don't participate or abide by street laws or street codes. You try you me like, how do you feel like real niggas have to abide by street codes and? Cause that's what the real niggas do. Cause why, every time somebody why, so say how, they, how do you feel? How, how how could you say that that's a real nigga if you don't even consider yourself a real nigga? Like you, I'm not you a real, real nigga. I'm just a no, man. No real niggas. They, that's what you look at them like. They real niggas. No, because because in the black community. Wait, 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 wait. Slow down, slow down. Both yes. of us can't. Both of us can't talk at the same time. Slow down, slow down. So this is what I'm saying. Only in the black community. Where black men have to be a street, they have to be attached to the streets. So I say all the time, what? When does a black man let the streets go? Why? Why is it he have to be street? He got to be hood. No other race have to do that except black men. So no, I'm not a street nigga or real or real nigga. I'm just a man. And that's just your opinion, though. Like that's, you said, well, that's my opinion. Because you have Mexicans that are in gangs and that are attached. To the street. But, but, but no, 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 no. Mexicans ain't gunning down other Mexicans, dude. I don't see black men going gunning down other black men. I don't know. I'm not a black man, so I really can't speak. For oh, right. right. But, but, but you having sex with those black men who probably doing that. I've had, I've had, but that don't mean I, I care to get to know why they doing it. That ain't got nothing to do with me. So, so you don't feel like women who are involved with those criminals are part of the... I just find it... Oh, let me I say can't say because I'm not involved with criminals, so I don't really know. But, but let me say this, too, before I let you go. Well, how can women say they're part of the Black Lives Matter movement, but they're having sex with criminals? Wait, say that again? How can women say they love Black Lives Matter, they're part of the Black Lives Matter movement, but they're having sex with criminals and murderers and, and uh, robbers? What's your thing of these murderers and criminals? I mean, do you think people just go out and say, wake up and say, oh, I'm just going to be a murderer today? Like, that stuff just happens. But, we, but with, no, what I'm saying is, so you're saying basically when he get killed by the police, that's that's you know his life is more honorable versus when another black person because in the black community we got the no snitching policy. See, I don't abide by that. I'm a civilian. If I see crime, I'm going to report it and call the cops on you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, but I don't understand it. So that's why I don't understand in the black community how can black women say they love Black Lives Matter, but yet they go back and have sex with murderers and their baby daddies are murderers. And real niggas and killers. That's what I'm having a hard time trying to figure out. So technically, you don't care about Black Lives Matter if you're dealing with these type of men. 
those women. Not, Not all women, just those women who do that. Me personally, I feel like all lives matter. I mean, but black, I mean, black lives do, does matter. Like, it's more white on black crime than any, like, police. They do be murdering our black men. Like, well, what about the other black men doing it? What about, the, what about those street niggas and real niggas doing it, though? That ain't got nothing to do with me. But why, what, but why y'all ain't calling the cops on the street niggas and real niggas? You said what? Why y'all? Like reporting them to the cops, though these real niggas and street niggas. Y'all go by the no snitching policy. I don't know. I ain't got nothing to do with Do you agree with the no snitching policy? Am I what? Do you agree with no snitching? Uh, I'm doing something. Could you back up? Mm -hmm. Um, I don't. I don't want to say I agree with it. I mean. I'm not just gonna like if I was to see something that happen. I'm not just gonna snitch unless it really got something to do with me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are you in the streets? No, I'm not in the streets. So you said it shouldn't be using that word snitching. You're not in the street. That's only for people who are doing criminal activity. What? That was snitching me. Snitching is only if you involve in criminal activity. If you going by the street law, why are people going by the street law and they civilians? They playing both sides. I ain't no snitch. I'm a snitch, but then I love Black Lives Matter. So are you in the street? So why are you using the word snitching if you ain't in the streets? <laughs> I don't know. Dude, I ain't got. I don't know. Dude, I ain't got so you saying that? I want. I couldn't be a person snitching. That ain't. I would mind my business. So, so you I saying that like you see a? All about my business. Like why? Why jump up and go tell? Wait, 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 wait. So you saying if you see somebody getting robbed, you're not reporting it to the cops? No, that has nothing to do with me. Wow. wow. If you, so, if you, you, so if somebody if robbed your child. I was robbed, you, then you, who? But what if somebody robbed your child? Wait, 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 wait. Slow down, slow mm -hmm. down. If somebody robbed your child, you won't know to report it to the cops. Handling myself. I'm going to try to ah, handle you, but you don't but before, So you're going to be everywhere with your child I if they get robbed. I wouldn't Whoa, 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 whoa. Listen. So you gonna be everywhere with your child, everywhere with your child, everywhere you go. I think not. You will want somebody to report it. Why are all black people going by this no snitching policy? That's because of bullshit ass rap music. Everybody not in the street. You are? Are you in the streets or not? Not in the street, but I don't. I don't exactly. Leave. So you a civilian? I don't go Stay your ass in the music. sidewalk. I go off my real life though. I don't Stay go off the rap. Stay your ass on the sidewalk. Go by that stuff. But why are you uh -huh. talking about you? You're not snitching. You're not calling. You I are doing a citizen's do duty. Me, but you're a good Samaritan, though. You're supposed to be a good Samaritan and call the cop. I see somebody oh, getting robbed. Is that the law? It's the law. I well, it's just people. it's called moral law. It's called yeah. moral law. It's called moral law. So women like, like that right there. Like if I feel like that about other people, and shit, it just. That's just is what it is. Like I can't. I'm not gonna get mad at the next person. Say somebody do rob my kid, and oh that person saw. I'm not gonna get mad at them. Like they don't so want to get involved, and they don't want to get involved. So you say you're not going. You, you you wouldn't want that person who's seen it to report it to the cops. I would ask them to. I mean, how, I would probably ask them to, but if they don't want to, I'm not gonna get mad at. But I'm not gonna get mad at them. So like, you, like, so if you see some, so you see, so you see somebody breaking into your neighbor's house, are you gonna report it to the cops? It has nothing to do with me. I tell you, that's why the community fucked up, ladies and gentlemen. Because of this right here, guys. I tell you, I tell you, this is what rap music influenced people. Rap and all people are street niggas and real niggas. Rap music has nothing to do with it. So you saying you wouldn't report it to the cops if you seen somebody, your neighbor getting robbed? That has nothing to do with me. Wow. wow. Okay. That ain't got nothing to do with rap. And those are the same women you see right here, guys, that would be in the Black Lives Matter wearing a t-shirt. But if they see crime, they wouldn't report nothing. it. That's why Black Lives Matter is a scam, ladies and gentlemen. I have nothing to do with that. I said all lives matter. I could care less about anybody else. Like, I digress. That's it.